Hi, my name's Becky. I'm a senior social worker in the Safeguarding Adults Hub. People sometimes wonder what domestic abuse is. It's defined by the uh, Home Office as affecting adults um, over the age of 16 who are or have previously been in intimate relationships with the um, person alleged to be causing harm. One of the areas that we support people with are with family members who may be acting as an informal carer if there is concerns that they are acting in a way that is potentially putting the person they're supporting at risk. I've supported um, a lady that was in her 80s fairly recently and was going through domestic abuse with her husband. Myself and other agencies of a professional supported her to move to a residential placement for a temporary time just so that she could have that sort of respite and that period clarify and think about what it was that she wanted to do next. Some people with uh, disabilities who are maybe a little bit younger, we can help to look at things like supported accommodations and potentially just general needs housing again with support of carers. We can support to facilitate meetings that may help to get all the sort of key professional involved in your care. We, we do appreciate that actually people that are in domestically abusive situations may be under coercive control. Our aim would never ever be to make the situation worse for you. Before we would come out, we would make sure that we tried to speak to you at a time that is safe and convenient. It may be that the best thing we can do is to try to work with you with other people that support you, whether that be a different family member whether that be a GP, for example, we can link in with services that, that support you so that we can find you and speak to you at a time that where you feel safe. Things are confidential, it stays confidential. We can look at types of support that you may need that may make the situation at home a little less stressful, for example. We can look at care packages, carers popping in, social activities that can get you out of the house, get you to meet new people. We can look at uh, removing you from the situation with your, you know, with your consent to allow you that space and that time to think about what it is that you would, you would like to do longer term. You're not obligated to do anything, just know that, that we're, we're available to speak to.